Texas is in the national spotlight again as lawmakers begin their special session of this, of course, ordered by Governor Greg Abbott. And as political reporter Jack Fink reports now from the Capitol, the voting bill, that's getting the most attention. We're calling this the suppression session. On the south steps of the Texas Capitol, Black Voters Matter, other groups and Democratic lawmakers vowed to do all they can to kill the newest versions of the Republicans' election integrity bills. We ought to make it easier for American citizens to cast a ballot in an election in the state of Texas. But Republican lawmakers like Matt Krause of Fort Worth strongly deny the legislation would suppress any votes. I think most of my colleagues in the House agree with me that I want to see 100 percent participation. And I don't think anything in House Bill 3 or Senate Bill 1 keeps the citizens from participating. The bills would prohibit 24-hour voting and drive-through voting that Harris County allowed last year. And the newest versions no longer call for early voting on Sundays to begin at 1 p.m., which came under heavy criticism because Democrats said it targeted African Americans who often like to vote after attending church services. Under House Bill 3, early voting on most days could take place between 6 a.m. and 10 p.m. and on Sundays from 9 a.m. through 10 p.m. Under Senate Bill 1, early voting could take place between 6 a.m. and 9 p.m. every day. Some Democrats have also complained that disabled voters who need assistance at polling locations would find it harder to find that help. Under both bills, those assisting voters at polling places would have to give their name and address, state their relationship to the voter and whether they're getting paid, and take an oath. We want to make sure that we're not putting up barriers to people to vote. We're making it easier for people to vote, just harder to cheat. So we need to walk that balance. Democrats say there's more the state should do. We ought to have online voter registration, like so many other states. We ought to make it easier to vote by mail, just like states like Utah. Last time I checked, a pretty Republican state. Both the House and Senate will hold hearings on their election integrity bills this Saturday morning. At the Texas Capitol, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.